So, um, carrying on. Um, I have been giving it some thought as to what we can and can't do. So, one of my biggest issues, I think, last night. I, right, so, first and foremost, I don't think there's anything we can do differently here. I think the cubes have to fizzle. Um, which is fine. But thinking about what happens after the, the, the cubes fizzle and the turret gets blammoed. Obviously, last night we discovered, uh, or, or we identified, that we could probably place this here. And I think that's what... I, I think this is going to be a legitimate move. So we can place this cube here. And by placing that there, that actually prevents... Um, that prevents the turret from staying active, okay? So, in effect, the fact that we spent probably about an hour last night, like, redoing a part of the map to get the life form sensor the right way around may not actually be... Um, or it, that may have been a complete waste of time. Because if we can constantly fizzle the turret, so to speak, then we can travel through that life form sensor as many times as we like. Are you with me? Now, the issue with this, the moment, is... We walk through here. And, oh yeah. Um, that's a problem. Right? That's a problem. Uh, also, Deathwish is going to join us by the sounds of it. What's going on, buddy? If he connects, just talk when you connect. Hello. Right All right. So yeah, the the issue with that at the minute is that we can't get through here. So first things first. Do we have a way where we can set a portal on that surface there? I think because we're not going to be able to come through there because we're not going to have a cube on there to open that laser field. So. Can we set a portal there and then return to the top? That's what I want to know. That's what we're asking. Is it possible? Deathwish is asleep. They were asleep, Death. All right, so um, let's not have that there a moment. Let's think about how would we, or how could we, put me this one as well. It's over here. How could we then get that to do that? So if we need to, we, we would need to open the yellow fizzler, right? Maybe it's sim more simple. Maybe it's simpler than I thought. I was thinking like we might have to like have to do some like really complex stuff and respawn a cube, but we could just do that. And that and that okay so how do we do a cube retrieval how would we now retrieve a cube Because we could drop down here, but we need 
need to get that cube there. Okay. So what if we used a second cube here? Okay. We're starting hot tonight, guys. We are starting off hot. So, we... Let's just recap what we've actually done here. We have simply got the, exactly the same setup. We have just moved the portal. By moving the portal, we are now able to get through. Think about it. We can now get back to the bottom once the turret has been destroyed. Okay. So let's now point this over here and point this one, say, there. Okay. So we're back to where we were. Let's just check that we get rid of the turret. Okay. Turret is gone. It's gone, Mika. How you doing? Welcome, welcome. How's your day been? No, what do we do next though? We could bring the cube through here with us. Benefits of that would be we could bring it over here and disable that. Disable the orange fizzer and disable that. But we wouldn't be able to change a portal onto there because even if we went back to the top and I opened that, we can't shoot through yellow. We don't have any of the other cubes at the minute. So we're potentially looking at... We could use that maybe, but a cube respawn. So... We were to respawn a cube... No worries, Mika. It's all good. So we'd have to do the respawn. Now, regardless of what we do, to do a respawn, we're going to have to pass through this field twice. Regardless of which way around this field is. So... Is this the spot, then, where we see if we can make something work with the mechanic? with the cube blocking the turret, possibly. Narcos made an interesting comment last night, which was like, um, what can you now do now that the turret isn't there? And I think this is literally the only other thing we could do other than 
having a portal and shooting on there, but I think to do that we're gonna need we're gonna need the other cubes back, aren't we? Okay. So Now I think yellow is yellow is active. So if we change this to blue, nothing will happen. Let's think about this. If I stand on the button, I have to walk back through there if I want that cube, which means a turret will spawn. So I think I want to spawn the turret first. I think. Spawn the turret first. Uh, okay, just quickly, I'm going to take a back step. I'm going to save here before I drop down, just in case not. Okay, so. Okay. Turret was destroyed. Let's go, Nerdlin. How you doing? Now we have the cube. Now we've got to think about this. We've got to think. I can walk through there one way. But I can't walk through there two ways at the minute because I don't have a cube there. Also, how do we get that cube back? All right, let's let's um let's try something else. Hello. Hello, good sir. I heard you. You spoke. Uh yeah, can you still hear me? I can still hear you, yes. That is a miracle. <laughs> Christmas miracle? Uh, whatever, whatever miracle it is, it's a miracle. Uh, obviously, I can't uh, listen to game sounds, but yeah, uh, nothing was working before. I could hear you fine, but weird. And my uh, Steam had me muted and I unmuted and it didn't make a difference. So, yeah, I had to kill everything. You know, uh, I, I, I never have audio issues. <laughs> never, never, of course. Nope. Nope. Not a uh, single it's one. A, it, it's a rarity. It was, I'm not sure what went wrong. It never happens. I bet I could use the FBI, Pentagon, Putin, uh, uh, any supercomputer in the world, and as soon as I put a, a mic in front of me on any of those computers, it won't work. I'm sure Deathwish can probably... Uh see that himself on to be fair. Is your uh, yes. your word all done then, Mika? 
You lost it. No. Hey, come up here with playing worms. Okay. Mika, no, you didn't lose Wordle. You've been on a, a a roll with getting in six for so long now. Yeah, you did. Before that, you were getting in five every time. But I gotta be honest, if I had, uh, if I was if I was playing Wordle in your language. Uh, I would have a streak of zero. <laughs> so, you know, uh, you've been killing it, dude. Okay. Now, if okay. I was doing, I was doing a different language, I would have to. I mean, I would have to cheat. No ways about it. Even then, I would probably still fail. <laughs> I'm uh, I'm right with you there, that push. Yeah, so far I have to say, if those of you who don't know, my primary starting word is arise. Or a race. Use race. Uh, either way, same words. That gives you A, I, E, R, S. My second go to, if I don't have an, uh, get enough from Arise, is Clopped. That has worked for me. Uh, although you could do Count or Cloud. And either. One of those three will give you the, the, the O and the U, the other two vowels, as well as uh, three of the other uh, most common consonants. So, yeah, arise and clout. And that's A E I O U, R S uh, T L C. And when I was playing the clone, I think I felt knocked this, when I was playing the clone app, where I realized uh, when I was posting it to his Discord, I'm like, what is up with those numbers? Like 240, 220, 260, whatever. And I was at like 32. I'm like, what? Why doesn't it add up? That doesn't make sense. And then I, I, I Googled it and realized it was a clan. <laughs> and they, they copied it 100%, uh, but the words were different. They didn't have the same words. And uh, it was actually slightly more difficult. Uh, but yeah, it'd be. Uh, I'm just waiting for my time to <laughs> get get to where uh, I haven't gotten a six yet since I've switched I've, I've been killing the threes and fours yeah you've been uh, you've been on point man seriously uh, I forget what what said what but some site or whatever said that uh, if you guess it in four that's like R as in like golf terms yeah it's par three is birdie two you know so on. uh but yeah so I, I mean i definitely try to get it within four but so far a rise and clout have allowed me to get three most of the time so eh, i mean Try it yourself. I mean, I guess it just depends on what words you think of if you get one of those letters out of those two words in a thing. 
But uh, like I said before, I I played Scrabble since I was a kid. And, uh, Scrabble. Uh, there's well, there's a crap ton of words in Scrabble that are never, ever, ever used in other word games. Okay. So, just if anyone's wondering what I'm trying to do at the moment, I'm trying to see if there's a way that I can get down to the bottom here now. With... With the ability to have the portal surface under this cube. So that when I respawn, I can take the cube back up to the top there. So I can kill the turret, but also pick up that cube there. So that's um, what I'm looking towards at the moment. Um, not quite sure how I'm going to do it, though. Because of the fact that as soon as I walk through here, I'm going to lose the portal surface. And because of the orange fizzler, I can't drop down. So is there anywhere else? I don't think there's anywhere else uh, where I can shoot the portal. Come. Looks a clothes horse. A clothes horse? Yeah. Um, so a clothes horse is like a like a frame thing that you put your clothes on to dry. Hold on. Give a sec. Uh, there are things that are sort of similar in the US, but yeah, it's not the same and they're not called that and I don't know what they're called. <laughs> I don't know. But I don't know how you would uh, F yourself up enough to cause uh, bleeding. How would I... Go through uh, here. I have an Amazon delivery once. Anything good? Beer. <laughs> yeah, I didn't feel like going anywhere, so fair enough. Uh uh I have Leftover fireball and ten beers left over from last night, and uh, it, it's cheaper to actually have it delivered by Amazon cold than it is to get in my car and go uh, two hundred yards up the street to my sheets and buy it. <laughs> okay, I got yeah. an idea. Uh, let's see it. I want to see the idea. Okay. Get to it. Respawn uh, the cubes. And then we're going to go back to the top. Uh. Then we need to do... I actually don't know if this is any different to what I just did. Thinking about it now. I'm sure we'll soon find out. Thank you. 
Uh, yeah, that won't work. Because the orange field is still in the way and it, the yellow field blocks our paw from the top. Um, okay, so let's instead do this to get rid of the turret. fly up here to save time and we'll take this cube with us actually a minute Excited again. Don't stop, Ellie. <laughs> uh, okay. Uh, I don't want to know. <laughs> <laughs> what the heck is going on over there? <laughs> you, you did it, man. You're wearing summer up. Setting is the only way I can calm her tail down. <laughs> I am sponsoring. Uh, well, two. Knox teaches me right now. I'm doing what now? <laughs> you, you, you're you're teaching Bailey. Teaching a what? Uh, teaching her a colors. <laughs> it's her to bang the drums, bang the drums all day. If I'm completely honest, it sounded uh, more like she was. I want a bang on the drum rod day. If I'm completely honest, it sounded more like she was um, smash, smashing uh, uh, a load of stuff out of your abacus, but, you know. Uh, I keep that much more of you. You know, you know better. See? You gotta show it again. <laughs> immediate silence. Alright, I, I don't know how this helps me. Oh. 
ladies and gentlemen. No better. Dogs. <laughs> How can I respawn the cube? Well, no, I can respawn the cube. How can I? Everything I want to do is like there's. So I want to get a portal on there. To get a portal on there, I need to have a cube on this button. But. In order for that to work, I'd already need to have a portal placed on the outside here, which is fine. But I can't bypass the. Orange Fizzler. So the best I could do with the companion cube on there would be portal either there or in that area there. I don't think that... Ooh, wait a second. Area might help. Okay, that area might actually help. Um, let me check something. Is this on yellow? Yeah, okay, cool. So, here's what I'm thinking. Down to there. Portal there. Portal here. Now where would I want this cube to go? I suppose for now and for safety I'd probably want it to go here. So it's going to respawn and it's going to give me the cube here, right? Oh, uh, wait a second, no. Uh, huh? Okay, that's not going to work. And the reason it's not going to work is because. I drop down here. I go through here. And then I have to pass through here a second time without a cube being there, so that causes the turret to be re Um. Okay, that's fine. As long as I know that I can't no clip, that's fine. But yeah, that would cause the turret to respawn. So. And I still want to have a cube. Yeah, that's what I thought. Alright, I best just check that that, um... I better just check... ...that this save is not broken now.
Oh dear. It's fine. It's my own, my own mistake. I should never rely too much on no clip. But such a lazy player, like just flying around everywhere. Luckily, the setup to get everything back isn't too difficult. No, it's 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 all right. It's my own fault for flying around the map. Okay. So. Just to be sure. Let's check it one more time. If I have completely broken it, then we're in trouble. No, nope, we're good. Okay. You're watching me in VR. I'm yet to try YouTube in VR. I'm sure it's not really much different to watching it in normal flat video. Oh man, I tried. Yeah. I, 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 I tried something. Uh, I tried just something curve, yesterday. Curve. Deathwish. Um, I think it was um, something to do with the International Space Station on the quest and holy smokes I freaking after about five minutes I felt so sick it was unreal <laughs> yeah I've, I've never had the like motion sickness or any of that kind of thing from the VR. No word of a lie that I, I like as soon as I started feeling sick, I like came off and it probably took me a good like 30 to 60 minutes to actually stop feeling sick. It was like, wow. yeah, I ain't, okay. I ain't never playing this again. Okay, so you're one of those that needs to take pills if they go on a ship or something. No, no, never. Oh, yeah, really? Thanks for the hydrate, Coco. I think it's just like the complete, like, separation of like, like mind and body. And I just don't think my mind can deal with it. You're, you're just too smart for VR. <laughs> Most of the games I'm all right with. That's that's the only one I've played so far, which. Um, has made me feel like proper sick.
Uh, so far, every game I played, uh, so far I haven't had any of that. I've, I've always been like, I don't know, like, you know, going to amusement parks, I don't get tripped out on anything. I don't get sick or uh, yeah. nauseous or any of that, no matter how crazy it gets. Uh, like when I went to Disney World back when they first, when they bear, the, the first year they released the Mission Space, which were the centri centrifuges. And you had those TVs, and you're in a confined little compartment, and they spin you around. Okay. And, uh, and it was, I mean, literally right after. I mean, we were there right after the uh, press got to ride them, where they uh, they were doing 4Gs, and they were throwing up. Okay. And, and then uh, when, when me and my brother went, uh, it was at a certain point in the evening where there was like no line. You went and bred it like three times. I lifted my head off, looked left, right, everything they tell you not to do. And yeah, I mean, doing that does give me a little bit of well, but eh, no biggie. Uh, I was fine. But they had dropped it to uh, three Gs. Yeah, I had no problem. I always wanted to go on. Uh, I'm not going on, but ride in a like F-18 or something like that. Yeah. In a F-18 Hornet or uh, the, uh, would love to go in an F-22 Raptor. Oh my God. That would be uh, any of those planes. Those jets. That, that would be so incredible. And hit uh, wearing the G suits and hitting uh, for short periods of time nine Gs. Yeah, I mean, I'd, I'd know for a fact I would struggle, but uh, but it's not sustained. But yeah, that, I would just love to do that. Did do uh, an acrobatic plane, the real tiny ones. That yeah. Do all the, the spinny, flippy, fall, go straight up and then fall. It's all different. Just out of control. With it's not out of control. It's they're in control. And yeah. Uh, you, you hit four or five G's and they was easy. I think even. Okay, that's really my fear is here. I'll just uh, do a death wish for a minute. So I don't, I don't know what to. I don't know what the next move is. I feel like the whole rest of the map is going to hinge on that, managing that turret. The issue is. How do I get... I wasn't talking to you, sorry, but okay. Um, how do I get this cube back into a position where... Just 
actually having respawned the cube, I need to get this cube back up to the top. And the problem with that is... I need to get through this field. The yellow field, the, the yellow field causes all the problems here. I can't pick up the other cube until this cube is replaced up there. There'll be no possible way to do it. Because once I touch that button, I've got to go through that life form twice. So even if I was like able to go in there, like come out of it, cause turret to respawn, then step on the button. Going through it wouldn't activate the turret, but coming back out would. So... The $64 million pound question is... How do we get around this? Libby just like giving me loads of confidence by saying this was the most challenging part of the map for them. That fills me with so much confidence. You 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 cannot believe how much confidence. <laughs> It's all good, buddy. It's all good. I know, right? Any normal person would have finished this like three days ago, T. Chapman. I just like making a meal of things. What's going on, buddy? How you doing? Hope you're well. That's... I think that's correct. That has to be correct. That then enables us to go around. And down. Okay, so I can walk through this twice now without affecting the um, turret, right? But I wonder if I actually want to do a loop of this. I don't really know why that would help. I mean, I mean yeah, that's pointless. Alright, I feel like... This has to be on yellow before I start thinking about what to do next with that. Because if it's on blue, the minute I walk through, it's game over with the turret. All right. So we walk through there like that. Excuse me. Now, what do we do? with this companion cube.
I'm back. Oh yeah, this is the easiest part. We already got the hard part then. Yeah. <laughs> Finally. Don't shoot there. Could shoot there. I was to shoot there I could then do one of two things I could either place a cube on this button but that renders this whole thing obsolete until I respawn the cube Mika you've read an article in which one guy hallucinated for several days after he played with uh, VR headset for 10 hours straight. Uh, don't believe every article you read. That's... Nobody's hallucinating from playing VR. I can guarantee you that. If I was to do this, put this cube on this button, the only way to get it back would be to respawn the cubes. And then we're left with the problem of then accessing this cube. Which is why I... Th need to raise your desk and stand up. No, I need to sit down. <laughs> My knee is killing. Um, I can't... Uh, VR... Uh, affecting your eyes. Nah. Maybe for a very short term, like 30, 60 seconds or something, but uh, I'm not saying it didn't happen, but I would find it hard to believe based on uh, VR has been around since the 80s. Okay. I thought of something. Uh-oh. In trouble now. Yeah, we're in big trouble. We're on a mission to win. Tell us something. We're gonna, we're gonna do it, Knock. Got it. Got this, man. Oh, uh, wait a second. Maybe I don't call it after all. This clears my portals, doesn't it? Yeah. That's full reset. Okay. That's not it. I kind of like the uh, the other night buds up the boost. Uh, 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 last night. Yeah, last night. Uh, taking a break, playing one that. Uh, uh, 
Yeah, I liked it. It's from Terminator. That's on all of. Uh, quite an interesting camper, I must say. I think I've played that. Just released it. Oh, okay, maybe I didn't play them. It sounds familiar. Uh, well, well, he put, he originally posted it on the 18th, and he updated it every, on Sunday. Uh, if, you, if you played it, you've had to have played it in the last like four days. Then I haven't played it. Uh, I'd say it's quite clever. Uh, it's got a first go ahead. It's got a walkthrough area, and then you go into dock and puzzle, which I find it quite cool for. He uses the uh, reflection gel, which most maps that use that are garbage, but I like what he did with that. What did you think about it, Libby? I mean, I thought it was quite good. Is there a way? I could have a portal on there. Almost like what we had originally. Portal there. Okay. Let's think about this. I don't know how I would put portal there though. So what I was thinking there was, if I could get a portal on the cube dropper and in the ceiling, much like we did originally, I could potentially cause a respawn by only passing through and retrieve the other cube by only passing through the life form sensor once. But... The issue with that is there is no way to get around there, the orange fizzler. And if, if there was a way to get around the orange fizzler, the yellow fizzler would block our shot up to there, which is kind of like uh, an intermediate shot. So...
No, I don't want to be up there. Jafool. Oh, wow. Well, that's, um... Yeah, that doesn't work, does it? I was thinking from down here I was going to shoot a polar there. And then there. But that doesn't... Um... Oh, I was going with the chat, man. Chat is going crazy. Got a fumbly, are you doing? Yeah, I can't pass through here because of this very reason. Okay, I'm, I mean, I'm not having much luck with the... So I say... Respawn the cube now. I'm not having a lot of luck anywhere else at the minute, so... So respawning the cube now is all well and good, but how do we now get round the the orange fizzler issue? Okay, so to move on here, I have to use the hole there. Thanks, Mika. Catch you later, buddy. Have a good one. So doing that's all well and good. We can go around here and we can pick up a new companion cube. And we go back around again. It's what we do f with it from here, because... The issue we, got, we have now, like, is how... We need this at the top. But after we cause a respawn, there is no way, to my knowledge that we can get it to the top. So I don't know... Don't know what. I don't know.
That's the only shot I can pull off from up here. Yeah, I have to say I haven't really been following along so much because it's been the same thing. And I'm very easily distracted. <laughs> Also, not sure what's going on with the uh, mic. Nothing's going on with the mic, it's just classic Death Wish. Yep. <laughs> uh, I, I can't disagree with that. I have to mute the volume on the stream, which sucks because I kind of like to hear game sounds, but eh. But actually, what's weird is I don't hear you. You don't hear me on what? Stream. Oh, now I hear you. Okay. Oh, uh, so at this point, what is, what is your thought process between fields, portal surfaces, and the cubes? That everything I think that's possible is impossible. <laughs> okay, well, you're on the right track. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't. All right, so in, in short, in short, I've got to do a cube respawn, okay? I've got to do a cube respawn, but to do the cube respawn... Gotta keep in mind this field because when this goes yellow, the turret is respawned. So, my thought process is I need to almost walk through here and prime this, respawn the cubes which will cause this one to spawn, respawn the companion queue, which we've just done. Okay. But then the problem is I don't then have a way to get the companion queue back up to the top because before I can take this cube out of here, I need to get the companion queue back on that spot because when I walk through there, to turn that back to yellow, the turret spawns again. Right. So it's it's this this cube extraction here is what's causing me the biggest headache. And what if you didn't have to do that? Try what though? at Narcos, because I'm pretty sure that's what I've just been doing for the last 20 minutes, thinking I'm doing something different, but it's the same thing over and over again. Also known as going completely insane. <laughs> yeah, Einstein. So what if... So, look, I'll, I'll, I'll run, let me run through it again. This, this, so this, this is what I think I need to do, something along these lines. I walk through here, 
because nothing happens to the turret. Then, if I respawn the cube now, that respawns, that respawns. Companion cube is then behind the two fizzlers. Which I can extract the companion cube only to above that orange fizzler. There is no way, if I do that then, there is nowhere else I can get that cube out to. Unless there is a way from here. I can change a portal before I spawn the cubes. The problem with doing that now is now that I have primed this here the only way then to respawn a cube again is to walk through here and that causes that to because I haven't got a cube there that turret will spawn and stay active uh, yeah I think what I'm saying is you're skipping over one thing that would change everything. I don't see a way to bring this cube into play. Because to do that, we need to do the, the stalling technique on the ceiling. But that required two cubes, I'm pretty sure. Because I needed to have one cube on the button to shoot a portal whilst this companion cube was in, stuck in the ceiling ready to come down again. So... I don't see, honestly can't see what detail I'm missing. Everything just points to impossibilities. Unless I can do something with this. Again, that, that doesn't help because doesn't help. Yeah, I'm just kind of watching what you're doing and you're missing. Okay, 
Let's go on Metro, how are you doing buddy? Welcome, welcome. I'd love that to be a thing, but laser field. And then this is pretty much this is pretty much a stalemate right here because we don't have a way to Seriously, it's that yellow freaking fizzler. It just wrecks everything. What can be done differently? Um, where? Sorry, I've been had my eyes shut, trying to think of the whole thing. Where? Where are your cubes right now? I only have one. Uh, you need to have all three. I, I can guarantee you, you need to have all three. But I don't see... Uh... Life form at the minute is yellow, so I've got two passes through it before the turret spawns, Libby. Which is why my thought process was... Go down there switch it yeah I'm, I'm yeah if you so switch yeah, to the life form just go down there yeah, switch. there switch the life form sensor to yellow then go touch the I say touch step touch the button at the bottom and then that'll drop it. But no, the hold on, hold on. Form hold sensor. On. Should, maybe, it, it should be blue right now. Maybe not. Maybe. No, I think in this situation, the. Life form sensor should be removed. I wonder if there's an intermediate step though between switching it from yellow to blue. I wonder. So let's think about what yeah, could I possibly do? Uh, I think it needs to be blue where that cube needs to go back. Uh, 
you're, you're close. Uh, I just think you're doing the wrong thing. Uh, of course, take what I say with a grain of salt. I mean, I'm, I'm seeing something different now. Now that I'm actually focusing on the map and the visitors and what the bottom does and the life form sensor does. I think the life form sensor is more important than it seems to be that I thought it was from the get go. Since there's so many uh, different fizzlers, uh, maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. I'll shut up. No, don't. Please carry on. <sighs> I'm just trying to think of other things I could do before switching that life form sensor to yellow. Uh, sorry, to blue which is priming it. So, I could, I don't see how, whether it's blue or yellow, I don't see any other thing to do regarding like positioning this cube. I could take the cube and I could push it on the button to disable the orange fizzler. That what would I'm allow saying is... me to drop down from the top all the way to the bottom. Problem with that would be I... Where are my portals? Portals are there, so I can come... Okay, 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 okay. So... Um... Do I take the... Oh, no, cube's here. Jeez. Okay, let me just try this a minute. Okay, I take this. That's that disabled. I walk through here. Next step will be to reposition this cube. Mm. Let's reposition this cube where the turret comes from. Now, I go back. Down. Activate this again. Uh, hit the yeah, that's what I was talking about. Hit, go, go hit the button. Then respawn the cubes. Go hit the button. If I respawn the cubes, I can get the laser cube out. Go ahead, I, F6, I can get the laser cube out now. Now. Yeah, that's falls over there. Boom. Okay. I'm saving there. Next, we still have access to get back to the top. Uh, no, I think you need. Did you take. I wasn't watching. Did you take the laser cube through the yellow? I 
Um, uh, yes, so it's now the laser field is now okay. set to blue. It's now set to blue. Okay, 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 that's, that's what I want to uh, No, yeah. So now let me take this over here. And this will give me my yep. safety net. Uh, I think Just you for need now. To take it. I think you need to go to the the the, the button on the corner and, and put it above. Well, so put it on the put it on the wall button. Yeah, I don't, I don't think that's right. There's, uh, I, I I think you need to take it to the. The, the corner where there's the button and the relay. To disable the orange. That, down, yeah, uh, to, to the right, I think. Yeah, to the right, to the right. No, to the right, to the right, to the right. To the right. Think, yeah, you need to have it, you need to have it underneath the green. Yeah, so Under the green. Wanna, uh, uh, I don't think I need it under the green at the minute. I mean, I might need it there later to hit that relay because that's that's okay. the final it's that's the there. final criteria. Okay, now you're you're fine. Uh, put it uh, now. Grab that. Never mind. I'm, I'm, my brain is going past through my mouth. Uh, hit the button, hit the button, and then put it above the green. Okay, yeah. And then go. Now I've got to get the companion cube back. Would now take the uh, take the take take that cube up through the portal. No, it, it doesn't need to be on that button. No. Now take it over to the uh, lift. Take it to the lift, and then yeah, take it, take it to the spot with uh, the designated floor uh, where he, he put a marker on the floor over below the purple surface. I believe it is. So, so basically, what you're saying is, you want me to put the cube yeah. where I put it originally, where you told me to tell me to move it. Yeah, I'm just trying to get my, uh, put it there. Um, I need to respawn. I need okay. to respawn. Go I'm not to, respawn. Go back I need to, to your, get the go back to your, uh, go back to your floor portal. I mean, your blue portal. Sorry. Why? I, I don't know what this is going to help. Uh, I mean, I can reset. This could to be... Uh, yeah, reset you want to be at the this bottom. again. That, yep, 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 yep. Uh, now go. Uh, yeah, no, this is this is right. This is right. Now go through. Go through the. Uh, uh, go through the blue. Uh, the blue grid, grid, whatever you want to call it. The person. Pocket snatcher. <laughs> go through that. Go upstairs and uh, uh, just head on over to the lift. And then you go through the uh, portal. Yeah, uh, grab, grab the cube. You, you, you switch the 
Uh, yeah, go back and grab the key. Switch the, uh... What do you call that damn thing? Life form sensor. Yeah, life form sensor. You switched it. So now, take it back through the portal. Take the key back through the portal, I believe. Hold on. Let me, let me think about this for a second. Uh... I haven't even got, I haven't even got like a, a trail of thought on this at the minute because it's just like, I, I don't even comprehend what I'm doing at this, at this point in time. My whole brain is just shut down because... Uh, take it... Okay. Take it, take it through the portal. Uh, your black or whatever the hell color your portals are. <laughs> Take it through the one that's in front of you right now. Take the key through that. You should drop down. And the, the cube should be above you, uh, uh, above the green surface. Take it over to the opposite wall where that button is that you can see through the portal right now. Today on Ultimate Just Backseating with Deathwish808. <laughs> okay, I, I will shut up if you want me to. <laughs> I just, I, I don't know, this, like, the, the last like five steps, I've just not had to think about anything and I'm just like, okay, well, what am I doing? I'm a bit sort of lost now as to what I was meant to be doing. Okay, should I just shut the fuck up then? Because I think right now, uh, you should go... Uh, up top where the uh, faith plate is back to the well hopefully I don't, I don't remember because I wasn't watching you should have the companion key up top so if you go through the go through the portal I, top, I don't think so I, I, I think I'm going to need to disable that yellow fizzler no, I th I think you're good. Well, I don't. I, I think you're good unless you don't have that. That companion cube needs to be. I lose. That. I lose my portals when I get the companion cube because I have to go through an absolute fizzler. Everything gets cleared. This field here clears everything, and no, it's the only well, way to well, get the okay. companion just, cube. So if I'm at the top, just, I got no just, way of just, just getting save through that yellow. Before you do it. Just save before you do it, but go up there. But I, I think it... Uh, yeah, up top, go through. Now go to get that. Boom. And yep, there we go. Uh, nah, I think, nah, you're good. You're good, you're good. You're good. You're but I can't good. do anything yeah. else. There's yep. nothing else I can do. So. Uh, uh, what, do you, what do you mean? You should have taken the companion cube stuck on the other side of the fence stood on the uh, went back and stood on the button with the, the ropes around it and placed the portal down below and right across from it no you don't need the companion cube in there no you don't need it in there can't do anything else with it though. Cannot do anything else with it because of the Did yellow. This, this is what I was, yeah. And this is what I was saying about the yellow field. I, th I think the yellow field needs to be deactivated because when you, and I, I've just screwed everything. But when I'm up top here, I can only see two portal surfaces because of that yellow, that yellow field. Okay. Uh, uh, Red leg. Because as soon as you go up. Uh, and take that companion cube, you turn around, walk to the right, drop it over the other side of that little fence or whatever you want to call it. 
Yeah. And then walk out and then walk out of there to the left. But because I've already walked through the absolute fizzler, I've lost my portals at that point. So when I come back matter. to here, you don't need your you don't need your fizzlers because you're gonna place new ones. You not see what I'm saying? You don't you don't you don't need them. Uh, go back, go back, and uh, I, I swear I'm not lying to you. Okay, for for good. Uh, did you not save before the? Yeah, I did uh, save. Yeah. Uh, okay. Well, just relay. Just because I'm not sure what you. Okay. All right. So, well, I have it in my mind. So you. Uh. Yeah, go. Do it. Do what you did before. Go down. Uh, you, you, you drop through, and yeah, go through the fizzler. Go through the fizzler, and hit the yeah, hit that, and then grab the the key. Now put it over top of that. Now go through. Okay. Now, this is where you step on the button. Now, portal, portal. There you go. There you go. Now, now stop and think for a second. Think, of, think about this situation. You want to go back down to the bottom again. Through the, through the portal. And then back to the fizzler again to get the uh, uh, companion cube. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, uh, your, your companion cube is at the bottom. You, you can. Grab it. Yep, there. Put it against. Touch, touch. Yep, there we go. Take it across to where the. Uh, no, 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 no. Take it. A, you want to take it across to where the redirection cube was and replace it. Take the redirection cube with you. Yeah, you just walk walk that across. Uh, uh, you just wait for it. And just walk that across, put it on the button, click the redirection cube. But you have to swap those. Now you want to take uh, that back to the lift, go up, and uh, go to the Uh, go to the faith uh, with the with the key. There's a timer on it. Yeah. to aim at the catcher. All right. That's it. 
and this is the point where I'm not sure what to do next. <laughs> Uh, do, you, do you see what I'm getting at here? There's my audio screwed again because I'm not hearing anything. Oh, your audio is not screwed. Oh, uh, okay, okay. Um, Hold on a second. Uh, yeah, laser, laser. Yeah, yeah, that's what I was. The, the, you need to be on the top button. You should have made the companion cube yet. You still, you need to still have that on the button. Is that that? Doesn't that turn off the orange? Yeah. Yeah, it needs to be back there. It still needs to be on the button. I think. It still needs to be on the button. And uh, your move is going to right. Um, right, I know where we are at a minute. Um, where are these poles? Uh, the So, uh, I'll, I'll just shut up. Um, uh, no point in me uh, saying what I would do, otherwise. Yeah, you're just not playing, so my bad. Uh have a hard time of keeping my mouth shut. <laughs> um. But I, I'll, I, I, the last thing I'll say is uh, I think the, the uh, Companion cube should be on the button right now, and you should have a portal to your right, 90 degrees from where you are. Not that button, the button down below on the wall. Yeah, I know, but I gotta do that to get one back uh, here, yeah, so. yeah, 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 um, yeah, I'm just... <laughs> yeah, but, uh, and then what I'm the way I'm seeing it back up top and then a portal where you came out of and one down below to the right yeah the the, the yeah, I think the, the laser is where you want to be, but not in the way you're doing it. Oh. 
Uh, I'd say, I think F6. I think you're good at F6. Maybe, uh, with, with his, uh, what is, uh, Narcos could say if F6 is good at this point. I think so. It's, um, a manual safe spot. Yeah, well, that works. That way it doesn't matter. Um, I, I, I think you're good where you are right now. Just depending on what you need from here. Shy Gal Coco. Did something happen? We're really doing all right. Who are we talking to? I'm, I've kind of not been paying attention to the chat, here. so. The only thing I can do is bring this cube out, but that seems counterproductive based on what we just did. No, no. Uh... Uh, I've just been running my mouth about my thoughts on what should be done, and he's kind of done what I've said, but uh, I, I feel like I'm... That's beside the point of what should be done. I mean, it's his game to play, not mine. That's all. So then... Yeah. I'm, uh, I'm not a... I'm not 100% sure what I would do from here. I have ideas, but at the same time, it would be pointless for me to say anything. Do that. And then, let's think about this. Um, okay, it could work. Then we can do that and that. Drop back down. I was thinking, trying to then. I, I was thinking after your save spot, you need to go grab the cube off the button, the companion cube off the button on the wall, and bring it up to the top of the worked off area and put it on that. Does that make me... sense to you? Well, I didn't. I was mid thought myself, so I didn't really catch what you said fully. Um, well, I just think. Okay, so the companion cube is on the wall button. Now it's portal, portal. Which you have. Uh, because this, this obviously right. opens up the yellow fizzler, right? And my thought process is, I know I can achieve that with the cube and the portal in another place, which is with the cube on the orange fizzler going through there, shooting through at that angle there. Now... Um, my thought is just putting the portals on the walls behind you, grabbing the 
kind of keep bringing it up where you are and put it on my butt right now. Which you, you would do with the lights So you stand on the button uh, up top with the roof area. Uh, fire the laser at the receiver. And then. And then. Go over and move, uh, move the portal, go down, press the button, drop the companion key, and then bring it back up top. Like where the save was, uh, with the companion cube on the button on the wall, and then using the laser to open, and then, uh, and then, uh, and then refire the or fire the portal, go down to the bottom, push the button that disables the, the bottom fizzler to drop the companion key, bring the companion key through the portal up top, put it on the button. Is that what needs to be done? Feel free, Narcos, feel free, buddy. Okay. Uh, I, I guess he's not hearing me, or I don't know. Uh, okay, so I'm correct in my assumption, but yeah, he's, he's not telling me what if I'm correct in my assumption on the next moves. I move. Okay, I think. Um, don't actually. I don't think at all. All right, let me just think about this. If I was to go and get. Okay, Jay, you got that there. Yeah. I go and put this back over here now. Bring it out to here. I can walk, it doesn't matter, I can walk out there myself, it's fine. Gotta go back around anyway. Yeah. Uh, oh no, right. no, not because we don't uh, access the, comp the we don't access this anymore. The, the mistake I think you made is that you need to bring the redirection key back up there. Uh, to where you just were. See what I'm saying? 
to where it was before I moved it. Like, uh, got the absolute fizzler, hit the button, just the timer. You grab the, uh, yeah, what you're doing there, but put it, put it on the, no, put it on the, uh, go through the floor portal. Behind you. Yeah. Okay. Right, go through the floor portal. And the other portal should be on the same level as the wall. Like, hit the button on the wall and place the portal on the wall straight across from me. No, hit the button where you are. There, yeah. And then put the portal there, and then take the redirection cube. Yeah, to there. All right, I think that's uh, correct uh, in our case. Is that correct? I see an issue with that though because no, um, I don't. Yeah, but the issue is I can't get to the top area anymore unless I respawn both the cubes because um, that companion cube is now isolated in that top area and I can't get to it. You. Yeah, you don't need to. No, you don't need to. Um, you don't need to go... Hold on a second. I, 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 no, you, you, you don't need to be up there where you are. Um, yeah, as soon as you went through, you're fine. You don't need to be up there. Uh, oh, uh, turn around, turn around, turn around. Uh, no, not there. 180. 180. The, that, the, where the lift is, put a portal there. Yeah, down there. Yep. And then check the key back to the wall button. Take the, uh, I can't take the key to the, the wall button. button. I can't. Oh, you don't have it. No, you need to, yeah, you need to go back and bring it with you. So that when you drop down, you have the redirection cube with you. Like that. To the wall button. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. And then you go, uh, and once you put it on that, go back to the uh, absolute fizzler, uh, the lift. And then you go up to the fizzler again. Fuck, it's calling. Ah, oh, bam. And then go, uh, no, uh, yeah, yeah, get, well, go through to, yeah, go through the fizzler, go to the, uh, that, the faith plate, faith plate. And then put a portal, uh, the portal that, uh, to go down to the bottom. The, Where? I don't, I don't know which portal you have at the bottom, but, uh, put, put the other one. I don't have any portals at the minute. I didn't shoot anything after I came through the fizzler.
Yeah, you should have a portal. Below the left, because that's the one that doesn't disappear. It's just recess. And then go through the which the uh, oh hold on the uh, the yellow it should be yellow not blue. Yeah. I've got to respawn because I can't get the companion cube back any other way. Right. Yeah, that should be yellow. Nah, I, I think you must step. It was yellow before I walked through it. Oh, oh, okay. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah but yeah, if that was blue right. and I walked through in that turn, that uh, yellow, uh, that would have spawned uh, a turret, so that would have be... been... Uh, okay, have you stepped on the button yet? Oh. Yeah, step on the button. Save if you want. And then, yeah, go, go back out. Up the stairs. Uh, you should have the companion cube. Uh, uh, yeah, above. Yep, yeah, and then... Catch a lift, take it up to the floor button, uh, the floor portal surface. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I'm already there. Okay. Uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But where's, where's the cube? The cube's still down the bottom because I had to take it off there, but I need to um I need to drop it down from here. Okay, yeah. Okay. And then take the lift up. To the lift up. Now I need to drop the cube down here. Uh, no. That I think right. I need to. I feel right. like I need to maintain that portal there. Uh, keep the portal on the floor. Portal on the uh, wall where the lift is. All right. Well, uh, I think I've screwed that good and proper. Yeah, I think you need to have the portal down by that lift. That's that. That's the most one of the most important. Portal surfaces. It, 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 it seems to me. Set some stuff. Mm -hmm. 
תודה, תודה. But he would not be happy with you with that uh, cube orientation. <laughs> trying to keep up with you, but I can't. Um, yeah, we're on different wavelengths. I just want uh, to reset some stuff, but it's not easy to do. Yeah, I'm, I'm not 100%, 100% certain. I think I'm on the right path, but uh, I don't know if you are or not either. You know what I mean? I, I think we're close. Uh, I had to go back like a few steps because I didn't save, so. Um. Right, I need to try and remember what I did. This cube went up to there. But I had a portal on there. And I dropped down to there. And I don't remember where the laser cube was. Keeps here. Do that to there. How did I bring this cube up? Um, Where the hell did that ad come from? What? Uh, had you at full screen and a big fucking ad came up at the bottom and made your stream small. Never seen that before. And it, and it just went away and you're back to full screen. Okay. What the hell? Okay, I need a I need another ad blocker apparently. So what we did. Yep. 
yeah, 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 yeah. Let's do that. Then we walk through here. Cubes were respawned. We have the companion cube here. I think before that does that, I need to change that to there. Yes, we're still on this map. It's not the easiest map. Okay, so from here I can do multiple things. I can disable the orange. go back through this portal here. Then if I need to, I can now change my portal positions, but I can't change them very far. Um, Take this over here. And what this should allow me to do is block off the turret spawn again. which in turn will now let me go and get the other cube back. I don't know how this is really any different to what we did before, but I'm just going to roll with it for now. So now I can walk through here freely. to worry about doing that. Let's see. I think it's more important to it's more important now to do what? I'm also worried that I haven't used that field there. Here, I feel like <sighs> did I make a mistake? 
moving this so early. Got to get the... Well, we can pick up the other cube now. We can actually get to a position where we could end up with both cubes. Both cubes in this top area now. I don't know if that's new or different. We'll save there just in case. Cube should be on that uh, the square diamond and the redirection cube on the button, and then you go through the absolute fizzler or whatever that fizzler is. Hit, hit the timer button on the wall. All right, let me get and then fire on the blue portal surface, and then go to the move this back uh, here. Yeah, put that on the yeah, put that over there. Come out, go through the uh, go, go through the uh, that thing twice. Spawn the cubes again. 
Yeah. Yeah, you gotta re you, you definitely gotta respawn them again. Uh because again I'm in the same position where I was before, I'm stuck down here. Well, I'm not stuck down right. here, but I can't maintain portals. Uh, you, you got a portal where you need it. Uh, by the lift. But the, I, I, uh, and, and the then, problem is, the, the problem is, this. How is this setup any different to the setup I had? Um, at the time of doing the last respawn. Exactly the same. Uh, well. The only difference is the cubes are in the cubes are in different places. Right, and that's that's actually the key, I think. Uh, so you don't need the wood to go back to where. Don't take the wood. I'm just I'm just looking, I'm just looking. Okay. Um. Now the the redirection cube should not be on that button anymore. Well, I haven't I haven't respawned the cubes. Okay, that's right, you did. Yeah. Uh, shit. Uh, when you're down below. Hold on. Okay, where it is now, you go through, fire the, the blue portal, or, or, or the RA portal on the blue looking surface on the wall. When you hit the timer button on the wall, the, and then go to the recycling portal, uh, so okay, so do what we get, just did get, again, get through there, basically. And then... Yeah, hit that. Fire on that. Get to the recycling. Uh, uh, yeah, go through the... Yeah, go through... Uh, 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 that, that's not right. Uh, 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 yeah, go... No, 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 no. Uh, yeah, I think you're right where you were. Like when you, when you hit that timer, hit the blue, go to the faith point, go to the floor with the other portal, and then go through the, uh, which we call it the blue yellow thing. Yeah. I know roughly what to do for the exit. I think we worked out that move either on the first or second stream. Narcodes where we need a floor portal and we need the companion cube to um, spawn or respawn. And then it flies onto the button. Um, not quite sure how to get to that exit area just yet, though. Yeah, uh, fire. Should fire I not have respawned the cubes? On, uh, uh, fire, no, fire a portal on the left side. Where the left is, fire portal there. Yeah, I respawned the cubes, so I need to go back. Um, uh, yeah, you need to put a 
portal there first. Okay, go there. So yeah, that needs to go there. This part is great. And then this part, yeah, take fix it to the, the top button, I believe, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then he gave through the the that the portal on the that one and then the other portal there. Uh no. No. Uh I think once you go through that floor portal you need to go through the uh, personal puzzle thingy. Why I can't think of that, I don't know. But that portal over the top, other portal, drop through, and then drop down, go through, go through again. Okay, now. Put uh, a yeah, fire over there. And hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, you got a portal on the left side? Yep. Okay, I think, yeah, respawn. Uh, save, save. I think this is right, and then respawn, and then, uh, and then, and then you should be able to go back and get the redirection cube, and walk through the road again. You should, yeah, you should be able to go back to your right, redirection cube, yep. Okay, and go to the grid. And then, uh, take, take the companion cube, do the redirection cube, take the companion cube up to that portal we have, up the lift. Up through the floor, and then come back out. Oops. Yeah. No, 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 no. Go back to the lift. Go back to the lift. Go back to the lift. Well, I need take, to take put it up. Pen. I need to put it up no. here to get out through the green field. Can't take it through the portal if that's there. Okay. Yeah, I think yeah, I think that'll work. Yeah. Just take that through the portal and then come back out. That just needs to be in there. Go back through. Uh, 
Now go for the redirection key, push the button, put it above the green. And put it on the, yep, got it. And then go get the, I think, I don't need to say anything. Uh, take no, and uh, take that, take that back out through the portal. And swap it out uh, with the redirection key. Yeah, you, you, yeah, 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 yeah. You gotta, you gotta swap that out with the redirection key. cube needs to be sitting on that field above. You know what I mean? So like, uh, once you swap out Put the redirection key above the lift, and then uh, remove the uh, companion key so the redirection key is sitting up uh, on, the, on the orange. Yeah. And then you can go through the So I can feel it. cube on the button for that to work. Um, the redirection cube needs to be up on the orange. That needs to stay there for the time being. Then, oh shit, uh, the companion cube that needs to be brought uh, that needs to be brought, I think that, that needs to be brought into the four portal surface area 
where the uh, fizzler and wall is. You know what I'm talking about? Where the little uh, diamond is. Yeah. It needs to be brought there and then left there. That way that's there and the redirection cube is on the orange surface. And then you can walk out through the, uh, the Fizzler area where you are now. And uh, just step on the button, fire a portal on the wall, come back out and grab the fanny uh, cube and put it on. Uh, no, wait a minute, no. Wait a minute. I'm uh, missing, uh, missing something uh, that, quite big here because uh, I need to be across uh, on the other side. Okay. Uh, question. I haven't. Uh, does the companion cube or the redirection cube respawn? Companion cube does, yeah. The companion cube does. Yeah. Okay. That, that's the key. That's the key. Uh, hold on. Let me cycle this through my stupid brain. Oh. Um, I've got an idea or something. So... Okay, what's on the... Okay, the Red Fizzler. The Red Fizzler Killer. Put the... Put your... Yeah, up top. Walk. Put, put the cube above it. Yep. Fizzle. There it is. There it is. Not quite. Did that, did that not land on it? Yeah, but it's not quite it. Uh, now you just need to fire on the... Uh, on the uh, laser. No. no, we need to, we need to use the cube, man. I know that disable this will disable this, which is all well and good. And then, oh, hold on. Well, that was some bada bang, bada boom, bitch. All right. <laughs> that was a motherfucker. I'm just exhausted. Uh, me, me too, dude. And 
I'm not even one that was truly playing it, but God, it's I, I feel like I feel, I feel like I need some kind of medication to recover from that. <laughs> oh my God, try to try to um come back in line with what you were doing and seeing everything. And if you ask me to do that again, it, it wouldn't be any easier. Yeah. Um, I, I mean, that's, I, I, I'm going to say personally that that's just super well thought out and impressive. I, wow. And I hate it. <laughs> just because it's so difficult i don't i don't actually hate it but uh good god it's that's um one of the that's one of the most probably puzzles i think if i'm honest that's probably one of the most how do i put this it's probably complicated no not com complicated it's not the word i'm looking for it's uh, i don't think i've played a map which is so the um, number of steps portal management like oh, oriented yeah. like that before i've played somewhere that, portal management is key but not as much as that um yeah. then also throw in yeah. the fact that you've got to manage the life form sensor and you've also then got to manage the turret once you've destroyed the turret. There is just like a thousand things going on with this, and it is absolutely insane. Yeah, I have to say, I could have never come up with anything like this myself. Uh, that's, dude, dark edge, but uh, that's quite genius. I actually... I actually find this one harder than Maestro's isotape. For me. For me, that is. Uh, what do you think about between... What do you think about between... There's a lot of steps in isotape. And that's generally a... a, a it's not super difficult. It's just a lot of steps. And as long as you realize you've gotten... To a point, but what what would you what would you rate these like between yeah, isotope I mean, and this one? Yeah, but I mean isotope was hold on. Um five and a half, eight, nine, twelve. Isotope was thirteen hours for me. Over Five live streams. Yeah. Um. I don't. Know, I think I don't. I don't know that I can really. I don't know that I can compare them, and the simple fact that that is because of the the fields in this one. The fields just take this one like completely on to another level i think with isotope at least there was like there was always yeah. something to try there was always portal service although it took me like so long and five streams to do it there was always portal surfaces and different things to try whereas this one was so restricted because if you like if you was at that top and that yellow fizzler was shut and you had no way to turn it off You've got nothing you can do. And then that sort of ties back to like the, the amount of portal management that was needed um, yeah. to sort of manage the cubes, to manage the fizzlers. And yeah, it's just, yeah, it's like Mike said, I don't think I could compare and can contrast yeah. the difficulty because of the completely different styles and the completely different elements that are used. Yeah, a hundred percent agree. I was going to say, uh, just in general for me, 
This map is harder for me. Uh, conceptually, uh, uh, Mike's map was harder due to the, the sheer amount of, uh, uh, of steps that had to be taken and, and portal management, right order, all that. Uh, this one, yeah, the, the fields, they always get me. Even on simpler maps that only had two or three, I, I get, I, it, it screws with my head. Like, okay, that does that. that does, I, I gotta keep reminding myself which, what field does what. And, uh, this one took me through the whole, the whole time you were playing. To, and that when I really started paying attention to get it, to even start to get it. And yeah, to me, yeah, and I got, you know, it's different for everybody. To me, uh, regardless of how many hours you spent solving, I think, uh, I think both of them, being that they, they're on, different levels of, of execution and logic, uh, I think are, are comparable, even though they're two, two, two different styles and logic of maps. So, I mean, I would, I would, I would put these in the same class of difficulty, even though, you know, one would take one person longer than another. I mean, that's just my opinion. I mean, don't don't bring a third that, to this uh, mic. Uh, you know, <laughs> and it doesn't take anything away from either one. I mean, it. Uh, I personally prefer Mike's Rose, uh, just because it's uh, more clean, more. It, it just I don't know. I I'm not a huge fan of of the many. Uh, fizzlers and stuff like that. Uh, not, I don't hate them either, but, uh, but yeah, uh, great maps, huge amount of thought, genius, uh, as far as I'm concerned, to come up with this, to be able to make it so that you can't break it and you have to go through this many steps to, to get it to, to, to solve the thing. I mean, that, that's, it blows my mind. I can't do that. Uh, that's why, you know, I've always said I'm a better map make, uh, I mean, a better player than I am a map maker. I suck at making maps, but anyway, good job. Uh, Mike Schreier and Narcade's incredible map. And on that note, I am going to bed because I am absolutely shattered so um thanks everybody for tuning in i appreciate it and um we'll be back i don't know if i'm i'm, I'm streaming saturday or not um i'll keep the schedule updated so make sure you check the schedule guys thanks for hanging thanks for sticking with it over the last few streams it's been a slog um but i appreciate hey, we support got through it. we got through it but mark you did it so um yeah, until next time, guys. Thanks a lot. Appreciate your support. And uh, take it easy. Stay safe. Happy gaming. Yep. Use your right, good stuff. Night. And, uh, I will catch you all next time. Bye, guys.